This tutorial is to show you, if you have an iPhone, how to get your push notifications to work if you've tried to get them to work through the Water Reporter app and they're not. Now, bear with me. This is a bit of a rabbit hole, but it will work if you do want those push notifications. Okay, so to show you what I'm talking about, if you go to the hamburger menu on the top left hand of your Water Reporter app and then click notifications and request push notification permission. You click this, nothing happens, and you receive a notification in your email, but you don't receive one on your phone like you should be after clicking this button and you have an iPhone, this tutorial is for you. So we are going to go to your iPhone settings. Your settings icon looks like this. It may be located in a different spot on your iPhone. Mine happens to be in the bottom toolbar. Click that. Next, you're going to scroll down. Keep going. What you want to find is Safari. Click Safari. All right, bear with me. You are going to scroll all the way down to the bottom of this page to Advanced. Click Advanced. Now, keep bearing with me. <laughs> You're going to scroll once again all the way to the bottom and hit Feature Flags. Now, this is a bunch of tech jargon. Deep breaths, bear with me. Scroll down, you can see that this is in alphabetical order. So we're in the A's, the B's, the C's. You wanna scroll down to find the line that says notifications. Do, do, do. All right, M, N, notifications. All right, this is likely toggled off. What you wanna do is toggle this on. What you're doing by toggling this notification on in your Safari settings in your iPhone is allowing Safari, which is what the Water Reporter app is being powered by on your iPhone, it allows Safari to send you notifications. So now, if we go back to the Water Reporter app, and we're already in notifications, but as a reminder, you hit the hamburger button, hit notifications. We want to request push notification permission. Now, this may not work again. We may need to X out of the Water Reporter app and go back in. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna swipe up and then you swipe all the way up to X out of it. Now we want to open it again. And we want to hit that hamburger menu, click notifications. Now we're going to request push notification permission. So in some cases, there may be a little pop-up that pops up here. I've done this a few times, so my iPhone is tired of me doing this, but there should be a pop-up that says, would you like Water Reporter to send you notifications? And then you click allow. From here on out, you should receive push notifications. Even if that pop-up does not pop up, you should receive push notifications. You know it's working if you get a notification in your email from Water Reporter and you get a notification pop-up directly on your phone. If you're still only receiving notifications via email and not directly on your phone, let me know. I'm Sarah Freshly. Reach out to me and we'll troubleshoot it together. All right, thanks for your patience.